Good day. I want to tell you about this funny little thing that my school does. Um, it's flu season. And ever since flu season started, obviously kids are sick. Um, as far as I know, I've never gotten the flu before. And also, as far as I know, I've never even gotten a flu shot. I mean, maybe when I was young, and I can't remember whether or not. But, like, as far back as I can remember, I don't ever remember getting a flu shot or getting, um, the flu at all. So, all right! <laughs> but at this school, um, they do this funny thing where during lunch they report how many kids in each grade have the flu and how many kids are out sick. And it's kind of funny because um, every day I teach a different class, a, a different grade, I mean. And so, you know, today I taught third grade. So today I eat lunch with one of the third grade classes. And it's like that every day, you know. Tomorrow I'm going to teach sixth grade, so I'll eat lunch with one of the sixth grade classes. And that's just how it is every day. So every day I'm eating lunch with a different grade and a different class. Um, and they do this funny thing that when they announce um, how many kids are sick with the flu each day, you know, they'll say, sixth grade, there are three people. Fifth grade, there are six people. And <laughs> fourth grade, there are seven people or whatever. Um, the kids will always listen really intently and when it gets to their grade, they'll like cheer or they'll, you know, be disappointed if there's a lot of students. It really depends on the class and, and the grade, really. So sometimes um, I'll be in a class where they want to have less people and if they have the least amount of people who are sick, then they consider that a win and they cheer. But in other classes, they consider it a win if they have the most amount of kids who are sick, so they'll cheer <laughs> if they have the most amount of kids. So it's just, it's just kind of, it's funny to me. Um, the whole situation is funny to me, but like the fact that they report the, the amount of sick kids and then, you know, the different reactions based on the classes, it's great. I'll be sad when flu season is over and <laughs> we won't get to play that game <laughs> anymore. Oh, so, uh, I don't know if I've mentioned this already, but a friend of mine from college is going to come out to Japan in um, spring vacation. I think I, I think I have talked about it. Now that I'm saying it, I remember saying it before already. So um, I'm really looking forward to that. Oh yeah, yeah, because I sent you to his page. I remember that. Okay, yeah, I already talked about that. <laughs> but whatever. Um, I hope everyone is not getting the flu or getting sick. I've actually, oh my god, if I say this, I'm gonna say it anyway. I've actually not really gotten sick yet. I mean, I've gotten kind of like, I've gotten a scratchy throat, I've gotten a stuffy nose, and I've, I have had, I have been getting headaches, but I, that doesn't count as being sick to me, but I haven't really gotten legit sick yet, and that makes me very happy. Knock on wood. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> I am... Oh, I'm glad you all enjoyed the karaoke video. That's why I made sure to leave it up for a couple of days. Because I'm such a good singer. <laughs> the best thing about karaoke is that you don't have to be a good singer. You just have to have a good time. And even if I'm the worst singer in the group, which I usually am, because I'm pretty bad, <laughs> I, I have the most fun. There's no one having more fun than me. <laughs> um, anyway, that's all. Um, see you next time. Bye!